All right, welcome back here with uh, Coach Kinsley, head coach of the boys' soccer program. Coach, congratulations on the win tonight. Thank Good, you. Good uh, district win. Talk about, did you talk to the team about it beforehand, about uh, starting the district season off good and trying to get off to the right foot? We do. We talk every season at the beginning of the year. The only games that matter are the district games. Everything else is building stepping stones for us. And uh, we've off, we were off to a great start this year, took a rough loss this weekend, and told the kids, look, this is the one that matters. Put everything else behind you. Let's move forward. And we, we struggled in the first half. But we came out in the second half and played a great game. And to get an early district win, it's it's crucial for the rest of the season. Well, absolutely. And I, I think, you know, I talked to you this weekend. And like you said, I think Saturday morning was a tough game to try to get up after the bowl game and all those guys yeah. out here doing it and yourself out here as well. And um, probably hit one that was coming starting the season 4-0. and Was able to bounce back, like you said, had a great second half. You got some great senior leaderships out there, but you also have some youth as well. So talk about how you've kind of mixed that together and tried to blend them to, to come together and play as a team. Well, what's really neat about it is some of our senior leaders were young at one point too. They were got they got some time on the field as freshmen and sophomores. So now they know how to help those guys get along. They need to get them into the game and mold them into the, the – uh, the heavy part of the season and that's that's crucial right now and then we got great senior leaders who who contribute you know a little here a little there and then are great on the bench so it's a team effort and uh the new guys and the young kids are, are stepping up and we need it for the rest of the season well absolutely i mean you you know as well as i do in the 43rd district it's it's anybody's ball game and it like you said those are the games that matter to try to set yourself up for the district to have a a good shot to to get to the region and, and make a run talk about what you got coming up the rest of the week Going into the next week, coming the games coming up. Uh, who you play? We got a tough week. We got Trinity here on on Thursday at home, so we hope everybody comes out to that. Uh, another probably top ten team in the state. Absolutely. And then this weekend we go to Moeller for a tournament, and Moeller is always uh, you know top in their area. And then we'll play uh, either St. Edwards or St. Or, uh, Brothers from Michigan. So. Uh, quality teams it's a nice catholic tournament it's good so for giving the kids a there. break the rest of the week huh? yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> well you know as well as i do is we've got to prepare for this 43rd district you can't do that without going and playing those teams exactly congratulations right. coach on a great win tonight Thank good you. luck the rest of the season appreciate All right. it All right. coach kinslow there for us And we're back here uh, with Geegan Bagley, um, sophomore player here for our boys' soccer team. Um, you were out there early tonight. We were able to get the first goal and get us going there in the second half. Uh, talk about a little bit about that goal, you know, what you saw, what you attacked there. Um, you know, talk about what you saw that uh, you were able to put that ball in the back of the net. Uh, we were on an attacking position, and uh, I got a great cross from my teammate Tussie, and uh, I was just able to finish it. Uh, after that, it gave our, our team a lot of momentum, and uh, we eventually scored another goal. So, great. Okay. Well, let, let's watch this go here, right here. Uh, we're gonna play it here for you, um, and, and like I said, kind of talk about it again. You can kind of see it up there. Like you said, you got the great cross. Mike's with a shot. The back of the Is that and they just score. That How about that? Second. Bailey with the score, it looks like. As a sophomore. Now, talk about, you know, I talked to Coach a little bit about the senior leadership and, and having the youth. You know, you're a sophomore here. You're getting a lot of playing time. Having to blend that together, that you know, that takes some coaching. And talk about how the seniors have kind of really accepted you, you, you young guys coming on, getting the playing time because they understand that, you know, it's going to help them. But talk about how they've kind of accepted you guys and brought you guys along. Uh, mostly encouragement. Um, during practices, they always encourage us to go hard, uh, try to keep up with them, and really push us. And uh, that eventually leads us to the uh, field, and we push ourselves and do the best we can. Well, that's great. Well, Keegan, great game tonight. Uh, like Coach said, you got a couple uh, tough games coming up. You know, keep, keep battling. Um, got off to the – uh, good win in the 43rd district. Uh, start out 1-0. and um, Best of luck the rest of the season, all right? Yes, sir. All right, thank you, Keegan. Thank you. Keegan Bailey there. Yeah. So we're uh, 
key up his goal. Is it? Is it a? Uh, Fights with another opportunity and a score. Nice score there for the Lexington Catholic Knights. Tyler Kinney, the forward, gives Knights. Hey, here with uh, Ty Kennedy. Kennedy uh, here with the scored the second goal of the second half uh, to put us up 2-0. Uh, eventually led to the 2-0 win against Lafayette. Talk about that goal a little bit. You know, we had uh, Keegan on a minute ago, and he talked about the cross he had from a, a teammate of his. Talk about how what you saw, what was set up, and uh, how you put that ball in the back of the net. Well, the, uh, the midfield was working, talking very, very well. Uh, the ball was played to me, then back to Jackson. Great ball through Jackson through, and just ended up with a finish. Well, good. I, kn I know you've – had a few goals this year. Uh, I know that coach feels that every time you get at the top of the box, you, you know how to put it in the back of the net, and you have confidence in that. Talk about your mindset when you get that ball at the top of the box. You know you're going to turn. What, what's going through your head? What are you looking for? Are you looking for an angle? Are you looking for a, the keeper to be in some position? What, you know, talk about when, when that ball comes to you at the top of the box. What goes through your head after that? Well, you have to, you have to flick your head. You have to know your space and where you are on the field. You have to know who's around you. You have to know if there's a ball open to space, if you can turn, if you turn open for a shot, and it's all depending on where the keepers are, where the defense is, and you have to watch your line always so you don't know get offside. No, that's great. And, and, and like you said, you've got to be aware, and that, that's for any athletes to be aware out there and know their surroundings, what's coming on. Um, I know every time I see you get the ball at the top of the key and you make that turn, I think it's going in. I think you're going to shoot it and it's going to go in. I know Coach feels the same way. I, and I know your teammates feel the same way, and I know they're confident about that. Talk about, you know, you got Trinity coming up. You're heading to Cincinnati to play Moeller and then another great team. Those are going to be three <coughs> great tests to get you all prepared for this 40th, 43rd district. Is that how you guys kind of approach those games is, you know, don't worry about the final result. We want to come out here and get better so that we're playing our best in the 43rd district. Yes. Uh, most important games, home district games. Uh, Trinity, solid, solid team. They always give us a great game. They're a solid team. All guys school, they're all solid through all, all their sports, especially the soccer and football and basketball and all sports like that. Absolutely. And they always give us a great game. So I'm not sure about Mueller, but yeah, we'll figure that out. Well, there'll be there'll be three great competitions, and like Coach said, to get you guys prepared for the 43rd district, we know it, it's a battle. A anybody can come out of it. I'm glad to get the win tonight. Start one and zero in the district. Ty, great job tonight. Thanks, Congratulations. <laughs> Ball inside, Lafayette's got an opportunity. Good save, Roberts. Save for Roberts. Roberts with a nice save again. The strike by Bishop. Roberts has been outstanding this ball game. Offside Lafayette. All sides for Lafayette. Jacob Roberts with the excellent save off the effort by Bishop. Girls here. Good move, shot, and Roberts with a nice save. Roberts with an outstanding save. We got another whistle here. Not sure what the whistle's about, but. A penalty has been awarded. A uh, free kick has been awarded. It's going to be a penalty, a free kick coming up for the Generals. So Lexington Catholic. Only Treadway lined up to take the kick. Lexington Catholic uh, called for a foul there inside the box. So a free kick coming up here for Lafayette. Knocked out of there. And we got another whistle. The free kick has been awarded to Lexington. All right, we're back here with uh, goalkeeper Jacob Roberts. We were just watching some of the highlights there right before you came on, um, and the last one was the penalty kick uh, that was kind of the indirect that was from about 
two feet away and you leaned over and said, you know, I was really nervous there. Talk about that goal right there and, and, and what you guys were talking about and making sure you handled there. Well, on that one, uh, we had just had to pack everyone on the line. He was telling us, can't be anywhere above the line. So I told my defense, everyone on the line, when he touches, go. And so I, I told my, I told them I was going first because I can, I can get out there with my hands. So he touches it, I just go, throw everything at it, and I was lucky to get a hand on it. Well, and, and that was a great save, and you had many great saves tonight, and, and you played really well. And to come out of here with a uh, shutout win and the first district win is is really great. We try to build off that momentum. Um, talk about your role. You know, I find it really neat to to be out here. You know, being an athletic director, I get to watch all the sports and and, and look at all of them. I find it really neat how you lead out there. You know, as a goalie, you really got to be, you know, you got to talk and you got to get your teammates to talk. But talk about, you know, how you do that with them and, and, and what you're looking for and, and how you talk to your teammates and what they need to, you know, kind of cues they need to be looking for. Well, for this team, we're a, usually a senior-led team, which I've been for the last three years. So I've built on my skills uh, as talking-wise because going as that freshman that's kind of scared to talk, uh, to growing up to sophomore and now a junior, you have to lean your team. You can't just yell at them and scream at them when they do something wrong, but get on them when they do something right. And you've got to make sure you direct them out there too, especially you can see the entire field, but they can't always see. So you have to really direct, and you have you can't be negative within just yelling you. Yeah, well, really I, I think that's a great point, and I think that's what I heard out of there, out of you, is that yeah, you were given direction, and 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 it is loud and it is boisterous. It is all positive. It is talking and just kind of communicating. And like you said, you you are uh, you, you have some uh, older upperclassmen, but you are uh, youth driven as well. And it's trying to mix that together. And, and you're very smart in saying that you know you can't get on them all the time and get them negative and get them down and, and lose that confidence. So talk about you know some of the youth out there, you know some of the guys that you've kind of had to pull aside and just go, you know, because coach is on you a little bit. So have you talked to some of the young guys about hey, you know, coach is just trying to motivate you, he's trying to make you better. Have y'all gone through that process? Yeah, I've talked to some of our, our two freshmen and some of our sophomores that uh, he may get on you, but it's because he's trying to make you a better player. And I make it on you on the field too, but it's just because I'm trying to direct you and help you along also. But they definitely have come along great this season and just trying to help them develop the best players they can this season. Well, that's great. And and you can see your guys' maturity and, and the way you are coming along, the talking that's coming. Um, starting off the season now 5-1, and one, um, started out 4-0, and dropped one this weekend, which was a tough game, an early morning game. Bounce back with a great two nothing win tonight. Are you looking forward to this weekend? You got three really tough opponents coming up. You know you get to go off and kind of take a tr team bonding trip to Cincinnati, spend the night, be be up there. So you're looking forward to the next three games. I'm definitely looking forward to them. A huge challenge for us, Trinity and Moeller, uh, two top ten in both states. Moeller is a great team. We played in my freshman year, got lucky to beat them in PKs, but I think they're coming back. They're ready for. Uh, they're ready for a big game with us, and we're ready to play a great game against them. Well, I think it'll be a great trip for you guys. I think it'll make you guys come, you know, no matter what the score is, like Coach says, the district's the most important thing. It'll bring you guys together as a team even closer than you are now and continue to have that success the rest of the season. Great job tonight. Congratulations on the win. Thanks. All righty. See you, man.